Good morning. Yes, we are in Cozumel, Cozumel. Mexico. One of our favorites. So I should have said Buenos Dias, I guess, Buenos but that's all right. Dias. <laughs> we are going to probably pop up and get some breakfast. Um, a little bit. They've already announced that you can get off the ship mm -hmm. in Cozumel, but we are waiting because we are going to Mr. Sanchez. Mr. Sanchez. Shocking, I know. That's right. They don't open until 9 a.m. and we got here at 7.30. And 15. I, oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. And I believe ship time is currently the same as port time. So we are going to wait a little bit longer before we get off the ship. There's no point. <laughs> but we're going to eat a very small breakfast because you know, Mr. Sancho's comes with all the food, all, all the, the drink, drinks, all the fun, all the pool, all the ocean, all the stuff you want for about 50 bucks so a person. Excited. So it's, it's our, our relaxed day. It's our go-to yeah. spot. So you know what? We're going to it again. True story. <laughs> anyway, but we may grab like some coffee or fruit. some kind of fruit, muffin, something or other. Light. Just to tide us over. So let's roll to breakfast right. and then let's roll to Kazumail. Or Cozumel, as the pr correct pronunciation probably is, but we always just say Cozumel. Cozumel Breeze, I'm coming for you. Oh my gosh. It's a drink. It's good. You've been warned. <laughs> Bye. Bye. There's some coffee right there. Well, there's no coffee left, but there's a little breakfast. I'm going to flip flap my way up here. Oh my gosh, they got a cake. It, oh, that's everything I could ever want. Oh, there actually is a lot of cake left in that box. Oh. It is Towel Animal Takeover Day. Oh my gosh. Look at all these guys snuck on the ship so they could take over. I know. Wow, that one's cute. I like how they do all the different colors and materials and things. Super cute. You'll be gone when we get back from Cozumel, so bye. They even have what I presume is a sea turtle. You a big headed sea turtle. <sighs> Grapefruit, cottage cheese, chocolate muffin and banana bread. I don't know, sounded entertaining. You got fruit, double banana bread, chocolate milk. A little overcast in Cozumel today, hopefully uh, It'll be nice to us. Every time we go to Sancho's, it seems like it either rains or... It's 12%. So Man. Like a weird it is. But we have the Harmony of the Seas in port with us today, the Liberty of the Seas, and there's another ship coming in. I think it might be a Norwegian today, and they should be going to the Far Pier. I think we're the only carnival, but that might be wrong. Well, if there was another one, uh, it would be right here, most likely. So I think it's just us, two royals, and whoever this little dude is back there. All sorts of photo ops happening. Mermaid. Mayans, I assume. And they do have the pedicabs there ready to take folks down the pier if needed. I think my lens is fogging up because it is pretty humid out here. going through the duty-free building today. Were they not playing this last time we were here? Because I was singing Love Shack. What the heck? Love Shack, baby! band footage. Ah, we 
we've never actually sat over on this side of the beach before. Something new. So we are look like we're going to be right over here by the restaurant. Okay. Free coconut buffet. So we are right down here by the water toys actually. We're not using the water toys today, but that. Maybe this is where all your fish and your starfish wait for you. Down Maybe. on this end. Yeah, could be. <laughs> uh, Long Island? Nice and brown, thank you. She the already, first one's always strong. She already sipped her drink off camera, how dare you? What time is it? When you want to know. Five o'clock. Nine twenty-one. <laughs> Five o'clock somewhere. So nine twenty-one. D's rolling on the Cozumel breeze. Is it what it's called? Cozumel breeze. I got Long Island. What snack? It might be snack time. Hold up. <laughs> Pro tip: You can get as many bottles of water along the day here as you want. Stay hydrated. Hydrate, With my your friends. Alcohol. Yeah, got to do it. Good stuff. And eat, otherwise it's bad. That's true. Carbs and water are your friends. Thank you. <laughs> the first one that you always drop. <laughs> How is your guacamole? Best guacamole. <laughs> I think it's worth coming here just for that. It's really good. But I got some nachos with chili beans, guac and chips. Then I'm gonna go swimming. Then you're gonna see some fish. All right. <laughs> Hopefully, maybe your sea star is still out there. Oh, that'd be amazing. It's been waiting for you all these years. Somebody well, said they came here last week and they saw when, when were we here last? A year ago. It's been yeah, waiting a whole Halloween. year for you. Oh, that's a long time. It is. We got a ticket to fly, which I forgot is a frozen drink. So that's cool. Vodka, gin, rum, tequila, good gosh. Orange liqueur, pineapple juice, and grenadine. Well, we're flying somewhere. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Yeah. D is getting all prepared for water mode. It's fish finding time. All right, well, we are taking our ticket to fly in the water because D is already out there to try to find some fish. So here we go. I got my ticket to the ocean. Well, I am already seeing fish out here around me. We got some of our nice little yellow and black stripey dudes. Sergeant Majors, I believe. So, I think guaranteed we're gonna have some fish footage. There's a few nice rocks and things right up here close to the shore to look at. And if you get bored of looking at fish, well then you can play volleyball. How about that? And they do have all these inflatables out here, but they are an extra charge. Editing me may have to correct me, but I believe it's $10 per person to add that on to your uh, all-inclusive ticket. Well, this is super nice already, so time for our inaugural Mr. Sancho's spin. Ooh, sunshine. seeing a lot of fish so I know you are. I feel like something's not eating. Oh well that's not a good sign. I mean I'm okay. It's just I don't know. there's tons of fish. This is really good. Yeah I see all sorts of fish but do you think she got stung by something a little maybe so some kind know. of a stingy dingy on your arm. Like here and here. Wow um your fish are usually friendlier to you than that. I'm hoping, I mean, you might have brushed across. I know a lot of times the translucent jellyfish, you can hardly see them out here, but who knows? I think it may be me. I don't know. Oh, you stung yourself? No. Good job. I don't know. I can't ever remember the names of all of them, but I know I'm seeing a lot of the Sergeant Majors, the gray dudes whose names I always forget. I saw some big ones, some big, like, orange ones. Ooh, already? I don't know what. That's them. cool. Oh. oh, man. Injury. Injury at Mr. Sancho's. No, I'm fine. All right, she'll suffer through for the sake of finding all that fish footage. You better believe it. You might have to pee on me. Right? Okay, <laughs> just let me know. I'm available on demand. Hang on, let me get a little more in me. I was like, you had enough al liquid, not alcohol. All right, by the time I finish this, I'll be ready. <laughs> ready to go. Okay. All right, she's off to get stung by all the things.
So this is by far the nicest weather that we've ever had at Mr. Sancho's. The last two times we were here, I think it rained on us the first time. The second time, the like no swimming flags were up. It was so windy. So super nice. We got to have good weather over at Nachi, which is literally next door. But this is our first excellent swim day at Mr. Sancho's. So things are looking up other than, of course, getting stung and the peeing on people thing. But besides that, looking good. Whoa, there's a fish right there. Hey, boys. Oh, two fish. I don't know if we could see them on this camera. Oh, three fish. Uh, oh, a lot of fish. These are the same kind of fish that came and saw me and got real friendly in Grand Turk. So maybe, uh, I don't know what they're up to, but I'm gonna keep an eye on them. Good gravy, she is way out there. All right, we're gonna win all the awards today. You can already tell. You know what we haven't done in a long time? We have not gone on a snorkeling expedition of our own. We always leave it up to D to get all the award-winning fish footage. I'm gonna wait until I see a fish right around me and then we're gonna look at it. All right, we're going on a mission today. Apparently now that we're on a mission of our own, um, they're not gonna show up. So that's how that works. Whoa. like three fish just from above the water so hopefully you got some good fish footage not like these not already doing a great job but you know what i mean i gotta keep up my end of the deal here too it can't just be all spin footage and pun filled jokes all the time i have to contribute to the fish footage too all right now back to d and her fish footage i'll just sit here and spin that's what i do What is the fishy fish update? So good. Oh. I can't hear Carly. <laughs> Uh-oh. Well, we can hear you. Okay. So, they have like little uh, statues out there. There's like a, they're like Mayan heads. Is there a statue of me? I didn't see that one. They haven't heard <laughs> uh, myths and legends? Dang. <laughs> Should I be a statue of a you. starfish. A guy had it in his hand ah. and he put it on top of one of the rocks. I saw, I went up close with a very large, I guess it was a crab or a lobster, I don't actually know, you'll see it. Okay. A flounder, lots and lots of fish. The clarity is unreal, like yeah, really it, deep too. It's nice today. This is amazing. So I put this like Grand Turk level snorkeling. Whoa, yeah. now that's saying something. I know. See, every time we've been here before, we've been way down there and it's been, you know, too stormy for us to even really see much. Yeah. But this is the clearest day we've had so here. Oh, good. Nice. It's beautiful. And there's some snorkelers out there, so they'll be in that footage. <laughs> ah, nice. The guy was holding a starfish, and I was like, okay. And I was like, now, you know, up. we have to say sea star because it's not a fish. Sea star. Sea star. Why do you fish? Because they're dum dumb. Well, then I'm dumb dumb. I call it a starfish all the time. <laughs> But yeah, so, so good. I can include getting closer to you. Yeah, the waves are pushing like right into frame, so. I think I'm out there too. Yeah, you went pretty far. <laughs> I looked up and I was like, dang, she's in Nassau. No, I don't know where you are. <laughs> That's too far from here. So thumbs up on the fish footage report. Yeah. I love it. I'm just sitting here spinning again because that's what I do. So if she's getting that much fish footage, I got some fish footage earlier, but it's nothing compared to what she's got. So. <laughs> come to Mr. Sancho's right now. We'll be here. Yeah, if you come here for the next few hours, we'll be here. The water is salty. I tasted some of it earlier. <laughs> a little bit, just, yeah. just a tiny bit. Yeah. All right, go get all them fish footages again. Gaga go, 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 go. <laughs> Guys, I just pinched her butt right before I turned the camera on and she like got mad at me. She was like, oh, and she said some stuff through the snorkel. I couldn't even understand it, but it's probably better that I didn't because I don't think I would have wanted to hear it. So pro tip, don't pinch Dee's butt if you ever see her snorkeling in the ocean. That's, that's just a good life tip because just don't pinch her butt unless you're me. Yeah.
don't. ton of fish that just chill right up here around this little I guess it's some kind of an anchoring point maybe for uh, I don't know something but all kinds of fish right up here oh my gosh all right let's go on another snorkeling expedition why not here we go Again, there's a ton up here that we're seeing. Can you confirm definite jellyfish. Oh, I've jellyfish. Seen, like, five, six, little. Gotcha. Yeah, they keep floating at me, so I keep moving away. I mean, they like you. They're your friends. <laughs> I don't know if I want those. <laughs> But I just got a little bit more fish footage myself. Preston and Gaylene came out in the water. She's taking pictures, but right here around this buoy thing, there's a ton of fish. We already love Mr. Sancho so much. And so now we're having even such a better day than we've ever had at Mr. Sancho's. Holy moly, but I guess can confirm that there are little teeny tiny jellyfish out there doing some stinging. They seem to be pretty deep though. They're not really affecting us up here in the shallows, but Adventure D has gotten stung a couple of times. But I'm primed and ready. I can pee at a moment's notice. That's, that's just weird. Oh no, you got stung again? Yeah. So you can see. Yeah, all the creatures love you. There, there, there. I mean, you can't blame the jellyfish. Little, look, look, yeah, you have all these mine. little, I don't know if you can see them there, but. My arms are like burning, but it's all right. She it's sacrifices. What I do for fish. That's right. I think I'm gonna get out now. Yeah, <laughs> we could. We could get a snack, oh, get another drink. I exhausted a lot of energy. The ocean will still be here. <laughs> so will the jellyfish. So will the jellyfish. <laughs> they little, you can't see them. I know. Ah. They just want to be on camera. They want to be on YouTube. Yeah, they might be. Woo. All right. Well, we may venture up and at least get a drink, another snack, Ow. something like that. Maybe I'll have to make a little pee pee on her arm. You never know. Look at so. all that. Oh my gosh. All right, hang on. I'm getting I'm get ready to pee on it. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think I swam through a bunch of them is what yeah. happened. Yeah. At least they're little and that's a big one. It's all right. There's a first for everything. Updates for now. Ow. All right, we are back up on land. Let's see those jellyfish bites. See if we can see them. Yeah, you got some pink marks. Dang, that sea life loves you. Oh, all that. Ooh. So my legs do right there. Oh my gosh. Well, covered. You know what you need now? Food. Drink. Oh, food. <laughs> food. Thank you. I love you. I decided to try the Cozumel Breeze myself. I feel like I've had one before. It's a lot of lime. A lot of lime. <laughs> Wow, that's deceptively good. Uh -huh. You could drink a lot of those, <laughs> and then you could be in trouble. Thank you. So we got a shrimp quesadilla, Caribbean fries, fish tacos. Have you ever 
chips. All right, we are going back in this dangerous ocean yeah. to see some jellyfish. So I think we'll do one more round of ocean swimming, then we might get out and get a couple more drinks, and then it might be pool time. We love some pool time. Here she goes. I think the fish spa lady is still up there talking to our table. That's one thing, you will get a good number of folks walking around trying to either get you to do massages, snorkeling excursions, fish spa, play you a song, take a picture with an iguana, a parrot. They're all very nice. If you say no, they just kind of carry on, you know, they don't hound you. But there are a good number of them, sell you a bracelet, that kind of stuff. Not bad. It doesn't ruin your day, you know what I mean? She's already out there looking for a jellyfish again. Oh, mercy. But we were worried this morning. It was a little overcast. All of that has gone away. We got nothing but beautiful blue skies happening. She comes with a fish report. It looked like she was swimming away from something just a second ago. Jellyfish. Aha! Uh -huh. Dang it. I think it's one of them stuck my lip. Your lip? Yeah. Well, that's not good. They're just like all over me. Well. I don't know if I want to swim in this ocean currently. <laughs> you attract all the creatures. Ooh. How can it be helped? Yeah, no, it was definitely like right there when I swam that way. Don't try to eat it. Did it look like it's somewhere? I can't tell. You got mask face all here. You were coming straight yeah, in and then you, you were kind of like and you turned directions. That was because there was jellyfish. Jellyfish. All right. I've never seen That's true. We must be here for jellyfish season. We must have lucked out this time. Lucked out? I don't know if I consider it left out. <laughs> I'm in a lot of pain well, I know. Usually we're always here when the water's a little bit cooler. We're here in like November. Uh, I think it's been November every other month. Uh, November, don't December. It. Yeah. Don't touch it. I'm not touching it. See, yeah, I think I've been swimming through stuff like this. Oh, uh, so what is that? Like a stick that's got jellyfish, jellyfish glob, 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 on it? Yep. Huh. Interesting. I don't know if I should put that back. Let's, it's going to hurt someone. Let's don't swim through that. That boat has a giant flamingo on top of it. That's awesome. D found a, a plastic jellyfish, so we're gonna take this guy ashore. <laughs> Rescued. Mine from earlier, I crumbled up and put it in my pocket and took it ashore myself. Cause I'm responsible like that. Responsibility, keep it clean. No matter how drunk you are. That's right. <laughs> I'm not, but. As I move around out here, I start to feel more and more warm spots in the water. I think the longer people are here, the more they drink. You know what I'm saying? All right, I think we are going to head to the pool. As, as long as it's not crowded. Oh, true. We'll see how many, yeah, how many folks are in the pools today. So, sounds like a plan. Let's get out of this jellyfish water. Yeah. <laughs> 